it's nice. It's a nice song, and I got to like be Indian in that song. You know, wear a lenga right. and um, experience the whole sangeet and the occasion of it, and everyone just having a great time and dancing and eating a lot of food. I believe you're, you're romantically paired with uh, with Sunny Deol. Yes. Right. So how, how was that experience? He is very shy right. and when we were not shooting I was so busy like going over my lines and everything that even it, it wasn't required for me to mm. be like chatting away and being very social with someone. I was like busy just um, trying to get the Hindi right in my spare time. <laughs> See I knew of the deals when I got the film because I watched the first YPD right. but I didn't know like the extent of um, their popularity or you know, obviously I didn't know them personally, all the stories and things like that. So it was amazing to get the opportunity to actually work with them and, um, you know, get to know them personally because they're an amazing family. Okay, so 2007 you came to India and you had this entire hippie thing and... Mm -hmm. uh, then you saw Shah Rukh Khan and uh, you decided that you, this is what you want to do the, for the rest of your lives. <laughs> okay, I mean, it so wasn't what, what, after Om Shanti Om that I made that decision, uh -huh. but um, yeah, pretty much. Okay, so after that, uh, what, what really happened? And uh, you've, you've done your acting acting classes and I did. you're quite keen on, on doing so this. I, I was believe you, you, you got, got into modeling after, after that. I did, yeah. So basically, in Australia, when you go for an acting audition, like a film or television, right. you need to show them a headshot. So mm. you, you, like, you go to the audition and you have to give them a headshot picture of yourself and then you audition. Right. And um, so I needed to get headshots done. Mm. So I approached one photographer to do a photo shoot. Um, for the headshots and then afterwards he was like oh you should really get into modeling and um, why don't you put your pictures on this website where other models put their pictures and then photographers can contact them and you know organize photo shoots and things like that so I was like I'm not really interested in modeling right. but I, I wouldn't mind doing a few more photo shoots just for like headshot purposes for my acting so mm. then I did put my pictures there and an agency in Singapore found them and um, contacted me and said like why don't you come to Singapore for a three-month contract and we think that you can be quite successful here etc etc right so then I um, decided to give it a go because I loved traveling it was just after I got back from the three months backpacking trip so I was like dying to go back overseas and I hadn't been to Singapore before so I was like cello let's do it Right. Chalo, it. let's do it. Now yes. that is, Chalo, let's do it. It's getting like Hindi very, very, very matter of fact. That's good. Okay, we'd like to hear more of Hindi okay. if you feel Chike. like doing it. Not in a, a we are not pick, taking your exams. Some words I will like. You're not taking your exams or we're not putting you in a spot at all. Whenever you feel comfortable. Okay. All right. And a bit of Punjabi as well? No, not yet. Not yet. Because, you know, it was a Hindi film that we did and I was so stuck uh, on learning my Hindi dialogues. I was like, please don't confuse me with like other, <laughs> other dialects as right. well. Let me just learn Hindi first. Suit Tera Lal Rangda. It's like, you know, it has that, that Punjabi nuance to it, the yes. entire thing. That was. So when you, when you heard the, the song for the first time, what was the reaction like? I enjoyed it. It's fun. It's mm -hmm. like it's got that typical Punjabi beat and everything and the Bhangra and um, so it's nice. It's a nice song and I got to like be Indian in that song, you know, wear a lenga right. and um, experience the whole Sangeet and the occasion of it and everyone just having a great time and dancing and eating a lot of food. Right. So got to experience that whole vibe and a um, lot of fun and a lot of people came like we had basically they put out a, I think it was an ad on TV in the newspapers. Right. that if any fans want to come and see the deals to come mm. for this shooting so everyone okay. got like really dolled up and um in their indian attire and just rocked up i think we had like 500 or more people that just came for the shoot that is at so, leicester yeah okay. so they were like in the background dancing and it was like an awesome opportunity for them you know to be part of a bollywood film and to meet the deals and mm. then obviously we had so many people in our film in terms of the backdrop it like worked really nicely so that was really cool. When the song was being uh, choreographed, so in terms of just getting into the... Well, I believe you've, you've learned uh, uh, ballet, if I'm not mistaken? No, ballroom dancing. Ballroom dancing, Actually, yeah. you are right. I did start with ballet uh -huh. since I think I was three years old when I started ballet. In Russia, actually. Right, right, right. And um, after that, I got into ballroom dancing and became very passionate about that. 
I uh -huh. uh, started to do championships and like um, won a lot of trophies. I have a lot of medals and things like that. Right. So I did that for many years. And, um, and then in recent times, I did a bit of salsa dancing as well. So like dancing has always sort of been an important part of my life. Okay, and now not totally like hardcore Punjabi and Bangla and all that stuff as well. <laughs> yeah. that, that you, so I'm this sure is that. the new thing, yeah, yeah. So, so do, do, do you do that? Pass, you know, they, yesterday they were doing that at uh, the the session night. I did. The entire typical yeah. Bangla, Bangla, Bangla stuff. Huh. Have, you, have, you, have, you, have, you, have you tried that? I mean, I haven't tried it before the film, but in this film I was nearly in all the songs except for Changli, so I got right. to do all those movements. And um, yeah, fun, fun stuff. <laughs> I believe you're, you're romantically paired with uh, with Sunny Deol. Yes. Right. How was that experience of being a part of a movie with a huge star like Sunny Deol? See, I knew of the Deols when I got the film because I watched the first YPD. Right. But I didn't know like the extent of um, their popularity, or you know, obviously I didn't know them personally or the stories and things like that. So it was amazing to get the opportunity to actually work with them and. Um, you know, get to know them personally because they're an amazing family and everything you hear in terms of like hospitality and um, you know, just being humble and all of that, uh, it's very much true. And with Sunny, like everyone keeps asking me, how was it working with him? He's such a shy guy. Did you have right. any problems? And honestly speaking, he is very shy right. and when we were not shooting, I was so busy like going over my lines and everything that even it's, it wasn't required for me to mm. be like chatting away and being very social with someone. I was like busy just um, trying to get the Hindi right in my spare time. So when we were like on sets though, he really came out of his shell. Mm. So when the camera is rolling, he's just full of energy and um, the thing I appreciate the most about him is that he's always willing to see how I want to approach a scene, mm. which I thought was a huge deal because he's such a huge star Absolutely. and then I'm a complete newcomer mm. and a few times I would hear him say like, okay, let's see how Christina wants to do it, let's see how she wants to say it, uh, you know, things like that. Mm. So it was very give and take and, mm. um, and I think the chemistry really worked in the film, so mm. it was amazing. So I enjoyed it, definitely. Fantastic.